hey boys and girls, we are going to do a little bit of science slash art right now. Um, so uh, I'm just going to adjust this a little bit. Sorry. So uh, you guys have your plant journal. All right. Um, hold on. There's these calluses. Here's my plant journal. Okay. And so I've just kind of been updating it as my plant, my bean plant is growing. Okay. And so what I've done today, and you guys should start to see um, a little bit of a green sprout growing, hopefully. If not, that's okay. Sometimes they're a little bit slower. And if not, um, if it doesn't grow, that's okay too. Sometimes they just don't. Okay. But um, so what I've drawn today is um, what mine looks like. Sorry, I'm trying to so I've got a tiny little green um, sprout happening there. And then I've also drawn um, my roots. Um, some of mine have gotten close to the side of my glass so I can actually see the little white roots growing down. And that's important because if they secure themselves in the soil, then they can hold on tight, especially if it gets windy, okay? And then I noticed that there is a little green sprout on my plant, okay? And that's all that I noticed about today. All right, second thing is you guys have a little kind of an art craft science project where you get to take, there's a felt flower and some seeds and a straw and some foam leaves and some yarn and um, some paper and you get to put that together to make a plant and then you get to cut up the little pieces and label your plant. So you should be labeling the flower, the seeds, the stem, the roots, the leaves. All of those are really important parts of plants, okay? So the stem is a really important part because it's what holds the plant up and down. We just talked about the roots and how they are what hold on to the soil. That's also where they suck up the moisture, all right? Um, the leaves are important because they bring in the sun. So our plants need sunshine and the um, sun, the leaves catch the sunlight and they suck it into the plant. And when the plant has enough sunlight and moisture and feels strong enough in the ground, that's when the flowers come, okay? So I want you to label that um, little craftivity, we call it, and that's your parts of the plant. And then finally, I just wanna show you the caterpillars. Um, they're getting so fat. So, um, I don't know if you can see, look at how big they are. Okay, there's a couple of them were squirming around here a minute ago. They are, um, I'm, I'm worried about a few of them. I don't know if they're all gonna make it, you guys. Uh, but they were, this guy's, hold on, can you see? There's one guy in there that's kind of crawling around and making his way up. They've spun quite a bit of um, like a silky thread in there. And I think some of them have got caught in it. So anyway, um, but they are getting so big and fat, which is what we want. Okay. So these guys are getting, they'll probably eat for a couple more days. And then they should attach to the paper towel that is in um, the container. There's a couple that have crawled or cr making their way up there, so they might be getting ready. Okay. Oh, do you see that guy moving? There he's going. I think I might have woke them up. They were all kind of sleeping a minute ago. He shook it. <gasps> Sorry. Sorry, guys. Um, anyway, so we'll just continue to keep an eye on those and then when they go into their chrysalis or cocoon, sometimes you've heard it called, um, I'll show you guys that again. And then they actually hang out in their cocoon for a couple of weeks. And what'll happen is Miss Collis is going to put them in, um, like a little mesh container and we'll, uh, attach the paper towel to the top. And then every day I actually squirt them with a little bit of water so that they don't get dried out. And then in a couple weeks, we should have some butterflies. So I will keep you up to date on those, all right? So plant journal, plant craft, and those are our caterpillars, all right? Um, have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow for our handwriting and our math. And have a great rest of your day. Miss you guys. Bye.